So I guess you have a choice. You want a war? Or do you want to just give me a gun? Every human being, as amazing as we are, still have our own human tendencies, which if we're not aware of, can be a detriment to our own self-development and success. While John Wick, the fictional character portrayed by Keanu Reeves in the John Wick film series, is often seen as a hero seeking justice, there are certain darker aspects to his character which we can use as an example of this here. So here are three dark sides that can be associated with John Wick which we can learn from. Number one, vengeance and violence. One of the defining traits of John Wick is his unwavering pursuit of vengeance. Whilst his actions are often justified by the narrative, his relentless and brutal methods of seeking revenge can be considered a dark side. John Wick is known for his extreme proficiency in combat and his willingness to use violence to achieve his goals. This dark side highlights the potential for a person's morality to be compromised when driven by a singular focus on revenge. Seeking vengeance and letting it control and consume you can lead you to doing things that are irrational out of emotion which can lead to negative consequences for yourself. Having emotional control is really important when it comes to becoming successful and allowing yourself to become hateful of someone to the point where it leads you to acting out of character or doing things that will damage your future is a situation you don't ever want to put yourself in. So even when things are going wrong, it's important to make sure your actions are justified and that you're not overreacting to situations by seeking vengeance, being violent or becoming bitter because a lot of the time, these actions won't be conducive to your own best interests in the long run. Even though John Wick may have dealt with all of his enemies, it did come with its consequences. For example, when he killed an enemy in the Continental due to his anger and then ended up having every assassin in the city after him, which he then had to deal with thereafter. Number two, emotional detachment. John Wick exhibits emotional detachment as a result of the traumatic events he has experienced. He often shuts himself off from emotional connections and isolates himself from others. Whilst this emotional detachment can be seen as a defense mechanism in the face of pain and loss, it can also be considered a dark side as it prevents him from forming meaningful relationships and experiencing the full range of human emotions. Becoming emotionally detached means sometimes that you may be affecting others negatively as this comes with bad behavior your traits and patterns. It also means that you won't be able to develop close and healthy relationships with friends and family in your life, which is important when it comes to living a happy and fulfilled life. This is why it's important to deal with your traumas and bad experiences and make sure that you process them in the right way instead of hiding them under the rug as eventually they will show and become apparent whether you like it or not. Number three, moral ambiguity. Whilst John Wick is driven by a personal code of honor and justice, his actions can blur the line between right and wrong. He operates in a criminal underworld and his pursuit of vengeance sometimes involves killing numerous individuals, regardless of their level of involvement in his personal vendetta. This moral ambiguity is a dark side that raises questions about the extent to which one can justify their actions in the name of personal justice. When going down a dark path or one where you're doing things that already may be controversial, it can easily lead you to doing things that are worse and worse as the next steps won't be too far from where you'd already be at. This is why it's important to stay away from situations that may lead you down a negative path. Although John Wick may have rightfully served justice to some of his enemies, it can be argued as to whether or not some of the people that he had dealt with really deserved what they got and if so, how they were judged and how the conclusion was achieved. It's important to note that these dark sides are fictional aspects of the character and should not be considered as a reflection of every man or John Wick's character as a whole but should be considered as part of what many people may potentially be capable of. Although many humans have their good tendencies, there are parts of human nature that can also be negative and detrimental if someone is not very self-aware and doesn't hold themselves accountable and doesn't strive to always work on bettering themselves whilst working on their flaws and weaknesses. And this is why it's important to always evaluate ourselves regularly and make sure we are in check so as to ensure that we are always on the correct path towards success. That's it for the video guys. If you did enjoy it, please make sure to leave a like and comment down below on your favorite movie in the John Wick series and make sure to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. Until next time, peace.